The 16th of January 1971 was particularly memorable. Les Chapman's spectacular strike would win Match of the Day's famous goal of the month. Opponents Arsenal would go on to win the double. You didn't have a tougher test, could you? Nicholson. Chapman! He's got it! Beautiful goal! 30 minutes gone. Not even Bob Wilson could reach that one. It was a good goal. It was a good goal. Funnily enough, in, in those days, when you're looking back to that era in 7071, it wasn't like the footballs of today. They hadn't changed like they are now. They're so light now. Players, even I can, in my coaching, can strike a ball and make a ball dip, fly, swerve or bend. And the great thing about Les Chapman's strike that day was he actually made the ball move quite a considerable distance. I do have, it's one of my favourite pictures, if you cut out the ball. Because I've got a great picture of me in mid-air looking absolutely a brilliant keeper, except if you look closely you realise that the ball's going in the top corner. But it is a really spectacular gymnastic leap. Sadly, it was a goal. We were renowned that if we got our noses ahead ever, you could say, oh, here we go, in that season, two points. But of course we went behind. And I think that most people thought when Ray Kennedy equalised, well, oh, there you go, they've got another point, you know, that'll do. But uh, it didn't. It didn't prove to be. That looks suspiciously like hands. Is it a penalty? I. I think it could well be a penalty. The referee going to have a word with the linesman. Inside or outside? Penalty. Even the most loyal Huddersfield fan would have to say that's a little bit of a dodgy decision because there was no way that he was in the box or even on the, on the line. It was as a clear a handball as you could ever wish to see. So Bob Wilson against, I think, Worthington, number nine. It hit the a goal. Yes, it hit the stanchion behind the goal. I thought it hit the post. It was full, it was a white hot atmosphere, uh, Huddersfield really had a lot to prove and they certainly proved it. I mean, it's a very famous victory uh, and uh, in our case, because we only lost six in that season, it's a, a very famous defeat.